Let's get started. Create a new composition. Go to composition, click new. Rename it to main. Size is full HD and frame per second is 25. Duration of this composition is 20 seconds. Now add a camera to this composition. Right click, go to new and click camera. Rename it to cam1. Now add a solid layer to this comp. Rename it to particles1. Now create a new solid layer and rename it BG. Move the BG layer down. Now go to effects and presets and the trap code particular plug into the particles one layer. Go to BG layer and make it 3D. Now open its transform properties and change its Y position from 540 to 840 and X rotation to 90. Now go to particles one layer and go to emitter. Change particles per second to 30. Change particle type from point to box. Direction from uniform to directional. Change X rotation to 90. Change emitter size X to 3000. Y to 1700 and Z to 100. Perfecto. Now go to particles. Change life per second to 15, life random percent to 13. Change sphere feather to 0. Size random percent to 15. Opacity to 90. Change opacity random percent to 12. Now change opacity over life using presets. Change the color to golden or change the value to 25, 76, 100. Now go to physics section. Change physics model to bounce. Now go to bounce. Change floor layer from non to BG layer. Change bounce to 34. Bounce random percent to 34. And slide to 115. Now go to auxiliary system. Change emit to at bounce event. Change particle velocity to 31. Life per second to 2.5. Change size from 5 to 4. Color from main to 95%. One more thing to do. Go to emitter again, change X rotation to minus 90. Now select the particular plugin and move the plugin to up. Now check if the bounce effects is working or not. Now go to effects and presets and add a glow effect to this layer. Good. Now hide the BG layer. Now go to Cam 1 and open Camera Options. Turn on Depth of Field. Change Focus Distance to 1130. Change Aperture to 150. Change Blur Level Percent to 150 also. Perfect. Now add a new solid and rename it to Lens. We will add few styles to this layer. First we add a Flare Effect. Go to Effects and Presets and add a Lens Flare Effect to it. Now change the flare center to minus 258 and 1067. Flare brightness to 100%. Lens type to 105 mm prime. Good. Now add a fast blur effect. Change blurriness to 112%. And click the repeat edge pixels checkbox. Now again go to effects and presets and add a tint effect. Change white map to light golden color or change the value to 24, 38, 100. Lastly add a curve effect. Change the colors according to your need. One more thing, change the lens layer mode from normal to add. To see the effects in the background. Now we have to add more effect to this composition. Now add a solid layer and rename it to form BG. Move below the particles one layer. Now go to effects and presets. And add a trap code form effect to this layer. Go to base form and change these settings. Change size X to 3570. Y to 1800 and Z to 390. Change particles X to 795. Particles Y to 22 and particles Z to 1. 
change position to 960, 840 is same of the Berg floor layer. And minus 200. Change X rotation to 90. Now go to particles. Change size to 1. Size random percent to 12. Change opacity random percent to 62. And change color same as particle color. Change value to 25,76,100. Now go to fractal field. Change effect size to 1. Change effect opacity to 12. And lastly change displace to 15. Now add a noise effect to lens layer and change the amount of noise to 1. Now add another dark blue background to this composition. Add a solid and rename it BG Blue and move it to down. Now duplicate the form BG layer and rename it form particles. Change displace to 30 in fractal field. Go to disperse and twist and change disperse to 285. Now go up to base form. Change size X to 2400. Size Y to 1500 and change size Z to 100. Now change particles X to 50. And particles Y to 20. Lastly change the position from 840 to 540. Now add a glow effect to both the form layers. Lastly we have to do some animation with the camera. Now add a null layer to this composition and add it to the camera layer. Now press P on null layer to open position. And move the timeline to zero. Click the stopwatch next to position to add a keyframe and change the value to 1140. Now move the timeline to 20 seconds and change the value to 100. Also change the size of BG Blue layer. That's it folks. Hope you like my tutorial. Thanks to CV Tutorial for this animation as well. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. <laughs>